Welcome back to Masterpiece Theater. Part 6 of Now and Future Champions continues with the second heat of the 1973 Kentucky Paturity. First heat winner Arnie Almerhurst makes a break off the gate, forcing a third and decisive heat. The happy glow quickly disappears, however, when Arnie Almerhurst, now leading from the rail after earning first post position by virtue of his victory, reverts to former traits and goes off stride at the start of the second heat. O'Brien quickly steers him to the outside, as the rules of trotting require. And Flirth races to the front for Ralph Baldwin. Knightley Wade drops in behind him, in perfect striking position for a late drive. And South Bend stays close up in contention. Flirth passes the half mile mark in a brisk 59 and 2 fifth seconds. Driver Baldwin knowing that Arnie Almerhurst is far back, still off stride and no threat. Young John Simpson bides his time with Knightley Wade. Then in the stretch, out he comes, setting Knightley Way down for the drive to the wire. And the classy Colt responds with authority, overtaking Flirth and trotting to victory in convincing fashion with a mile in one minute, 59 and one fifth seconds. Now the futurity must go to a third heat, and should any horse other than Knightley Way or Arnie Almerhurst win it, the three winners would have to return for a fourth. O'Brien is unhappy. Baldwin is grim. And John Simpson is content and relieved. Knightley Way has vindicated the young trainer's year-long faith in his ability to beat the best of his division. <laughs> 